right, there you go. All right, all right, perfect. All right, we are ready to go. Okay. So, uh, because Ed is going to edit this anyway, so we can stop and start anytime we want, and it's gonna be fine. So, um, yeah, that 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 that's what's happening. Yeah, good. Okay, cool. So, hello guys. And welcome to part two of the newly revealed Witchwood cards, all right? So this is a very quick impression of what I think about the card, how excited I am, if it's viable or not, and yada yada yada. It's gonna be great. Uh, and I will just roughly rate it, I guess. Um, and then, of course, when the whole set is spoiled, we'll do a full set review, we'll do all the stars and stuff like that. All right, let's start off with Witchwood Apple. It's a two mana druid common spell that does nothing, right? It's actually just uh, put three, two, two treants to your hand. And treants cost two mana. So for two mana, you get to draw three, two mana, two twos. That doesn't seem like an insane good deal because Force of Nature is five mana and summon three, two twos automatically, right? This is like eight mana for three, two twos. Granted, you can actually space them out and stuff and maybe if you have like a hand buff synergy with druid, that'd be pretty good. But I don't remember druids having any hand buffs. So this does look pretty bad. I'm assuming that the new expansion is going to have some cards that synergize with like a hand druid. And then maybe you can play mountain giant and stuff like that. But this looks pretty damn bad. Uh, and this also looks pretty bad in arena. So does n I'm not a fan of this unless something new pops up. Next we have... Whispering Woods, 4 mana for a Druid's Epic Spell, summon a 1-1 Wisp for each card in your hand. Alright, so this is, the, uh, this is the payoff for having a hand, right? Okay, so imagine if you are playing Druid, right? You pass turn 1, you Wild Growth turn 2, and then turn 4 you play this. How many, how many Wisps do you get? So you get 4 cards, draw 1, play 1, draw 1, play 1. So you get 4 Wisps. Hmm. I think this might be really good. Cause like if you play on curve, it's like four one ones, right? Which is fine. Four one ones is not like anything out of the ordinary. How do you abuse this? I feel like this is a little abusable. Four mana is very cheap for this effect. Right? And the fact that you can get like five, six, or seven. Hmm. You can also combo this with like Stuff like Mark of the Lotus, but Mark of the Lotus is real tame of standard. I mean, you could combo this with something for sure. So, yeah, I think this is a little potential, but I think it seems pretty bad, I guess. I'm, I'm not sure. This one, we'll have to see the rest of the cards, right? But this one is kind of a uh, maybe really good or maybe really bad. It won't be okay. I don't think there's a like gonna be this card is gonna be okay, it's gonna be really good or really bad. Uh, we saw that already. How Master Shaw? 4 mana, 3, 6. Hunter, legendary. Your other minions have Rush. And Rush is the new keyword in the expansion that is basically charged, but you can't attack the face. So you Rush that turn, you can trade, but then afterwards you can go face if you want. So 4 mana, 3, 6 is it's kind of like a normal stat line now, right? We have so many 4 mana, 3, 6s. War of the Elemental, Priest of the Feast, um, you know, even Cobalt Monk. You know, 4 mana 3 6 is not really out of the ordinary. This could be really good with poisonous minions, right? This is pretty gross. If you play Hamas the Shaw with like Gastropods and stuff, your Gastropods become assassinates. And Gastropod happens to be a beast as well, right? So that could be okay. And it's also a 4-drop. Hunters are not known for having very good 4-drops, right? I think this is fine. I don't think this is out of the ordinary, but I think this would be fine. Especially if Poison minions uh, are, get better in the new expansion. It's because the, maybe there are more minions that don't have a lot of death rattles or something that you want to trade more on board. I, I guess this could be okay. Did I? I didn't talk about the audit even cards yet. Did I? I think I did. Alright, whatever, I'm just gonna skip that. Alright, next is Rebuke from Paladin. Two mana spell. 
enemy spells cost five more next turn. Now, this is a very dangerous card, right? Like, just by reading this, is already very dangerous because it's two mana do nothing, right? But then in some decks, for example, I think this, deck, this card would be like pretty damn good in aggro paladin. You put a lot of stuff on the board, and then you play rebuke on the turn that what they want to AOE or clear your board or something like that, right? Um, and then it gets really, really good, right? It's also interesting to note that this turns off anything that uh, is like six or more. So they can't twist the nether and stuff like that, or dragonfire potion, ever. Which is nice. But at the end of the day, two mana zero zero Lotheb is very spooky. Lotheb was really good because a five mana five five was so good. And it on top of that, cast this. So think of Lotheb as like a three mana five five, cast a two mana rebuke for free, right? So Lotheb is obviously insane. This card might be uh, a little spooky. It, it's just good in Agro Paladin, right? Because you can play Divine Favor of this. So, um, card, card deficit won't be really that much of a problem. But I don't see this in mid-range or control pally. So, face is the name of the game for rebuke. Vivid Nightmare, Priest Epic card, Epic spell. Choose a friendly minion, summon a copy of it with one health remaining. So it's a three mana Molten Reflection, but it sets your minion to one health. So I guess there's a little bit of heal synergy or whatnot, but I think mainly you want to play this in the combo priest, right? You want to play this in like Velen or Malagos, uh, so you get like more copy effects. You can play this in Lyra, and then you have two Radiant Elementals. Wait, you can go Lyra, Ra you can go Lyra, Radiant, R Radiant, Vivid Nightmare on the Radiant, Vivid Nightmare on the Radiant, and then you actually have a Lyra and four Radiants. So then you can go like ridiculous. You can go just bleh. You can just like bleh. You know? So that could be cool. You can also combo this with like maybe some Defrado minions like Carnivorous Cube or Charge minions like Leroy. I think that's about it, right? Defrado minions, Charge minions. Yeah, I guess. But I think, yeah, I guess this is a combo piece, right? It's just a combo piece. So if you're playing like Dragon Priest, you wouldn't play this. If you play a normal Priest deck, you wouldn't play this. If you play a combo centric, then you will, I guess. And this actually seems pretty good. I think this is pretty good in Arena too, right? Because Priest is all about value. So a 3 mana copy something, it seems really strong. Especially when you can just heal it back up. Yeah, this could be good. Alright. Next up we have... Which is Apprentice? Shaman minion, it's a beast. It's a one mana zero one frog with taunt, so it's like a hex, right? Battle cry, add a random shaman spell to your hand. Wow. This card is gonna decide who wins $250,000 in the BlizzCon. Like Paveling Book. Yeah. This is gonna be a thing. But a one mana zero one is actually really bad. Um, the reason one mana zero one is bad because it's zero attack, right? Why why the one mana one one straw card was they were really good was because they were at least hitting for one, right? At least they can trade. But mana one mana zero one is definitely a bit worse. How good are shaman spells anyways? Shaman spells are like there's a lot of overload stuff. There is a lot of stuff that go face. But I'm not really high on the one mana zero one. So I don't think this is gonna be as strong as babbling book and your um you know oracle from priest or nazar's first mate you know those one mana one ones were amazing this doesn't seem that good but hey if shaman is popular then this deck might make it because it's at a random spell right man i just don't see this making it it's a one mana zero one why would you ever want to play that all right i'm gonna go ahead and say this is not good hagatha the witch Shaman, Death Knight, but it's not really Death Knight, it's like a hero card, right? I, I guess they name it hero card now. So 8 mana for 5 for five armor, so same thing with all the hero cards. Battle Cry, Hellfire the board. Or, oh, just the minions, right? Deal 3 damage to all minions, so kind of cast Hellfire for 8. And then you get a passive hero power. After you play a minion, add a random Shaman spell to your hand. That seems very, very slow. 
but it's a hero card. Hero cards kind of always make a deck, I guess. Like, it, like, hero cards are always just, like, overtuned, right? There's always something you can break with this. Especially with the new Echo Minions. Like, imagine if there was a two-mana Echo Minion, right? You can just keep on playing Echo Minions, and then you can just have five Shaman spells, for example. Like, two, 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 two. Two, 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 two. Yeah, and then you get, like, five Shaman spells. Or, like, you play Firefly with Hagatha, and then you get, like, two spells. I feel like you can break this somehow. There has to be a way to break this. So, yeah. I mean, I, 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 I heard that Shaman is the only class that's getting a new hero. So, yeah. That's cool, I guess. Next, we have Glinda Crowskin. Six mana, three, seven. Minions, your hand of Echo. Six mana, three, seven. That is a really weird stat line. I don't think we have any six mana, three, sevens yet. Minions in your hand of Echo. So, what? You can play Void Walkers. You can just swarm Void Walkers your next turn. The fact that this has seven health is actually really beefy, right? Oh, wait. This is insane in Arena. Alright? This has to be one of the best cards in Arena to draft. Because your opponent... Realistically, your opponent cannot deal with this card at turn six. Right? Seven health. That's a lot of health. And then if, if she lives... That you can just keep on playing one minion and just swarming the- This card seems really good for Arena. In Constructed, it feels a little bit awkward, I guess, huh? Like, how do you combo with this? Is there like a really cheap demon that you want to copy? That you want to combo off of this or something? I I'm not really sure. So once again, for the people who don't know, Echo is... When you play this- When you play a card of Echo, you get a copy of it back into your hand. But that copy disappears at the end of the turn. So it's pretty much like unstable evolution. I don't think this is gonna be that good. Like you you wanna play this in aggro, right? But aggro decks don't want a six mana three seven. If you can hmm. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, so if you play no Feratu of this, that could be kinda cute. Right? If you play the two mana no Feratu, you can actually mill your opponent out. And we know from from um from experience that mill decks in Hearthstone are stronger than mill decks in like regular card games. That's interesting. You could also You could also use this in Giants deck maybe? I'm not really sure. Giants might be a little bit hard, but Arcane Giant and Warlock? That sounds like a little bit of a stretch. Yeah. I honestly think if you want to play this, you have to play some weird demon stuff. Because then you can play like the Death Knight Gul'dan and then have everything come back and stuff. Not sure. But this is a weird card. Lord Goffrey. 7 mana 4-4 four, four for Warlock Legendary. So each class is getting two legendaries in this expansion, yeah? So 7 mana 4-4. Four, four. Battle cry. Deal 2 damage to all other minions. If any die... Repeat this battle card. So it's like a super... It's like a super defile. And it doesn't affect itself. 7 mana 4-4. Four, four. Wow, this is actually... Just clears the board, right? Hmm. This seems really good. Right? Defile costs 2 mana, right? So if it's just even... A, if it, Even if it's just a defile... This is already like a 5 mana 4-4, four, four, which is kind of close to the stat line, but it is better, right? 7 mana. 7 mana is not hotly contested in Warlock as well, right? Usually 6 mana is kind of like the break point, because there's a lot of good 6 mana cards you want to play, but 7 mana is like fine. Hmm. I guess if Lord Goffrey is good, then Abyssal Enforcer is also good? Because Abyssal Enforcer is kind of like... Lord Goffrey, right? But this could actually clear the board, whereas Abyssal Enforcer might not. Damn. Alright, well this is really good, obviously, for Control Warlock. Yeah, this card seems amazing. I would say this is pretty good. Alright, we already saw Warpath already. Scarlet Wasp! It's a 2 mana 1-3 rush minion, so charge on, mini uh, on minions once again. It's a warrior card, it's a beast. And has plus 3 attack while damaged. So I guess the point of this card is to kill- is to hit something that has... 
one attack or two attack so that it turns itself into a four attack minion so for example if your opponent is a paladin the hero power and then you play this you get a four two and you kill their dude the upside of that is not really that high hmm this this card doesn't seem that good it's like an amani berserker with one less attack and you trade that attack for rush but what realistically what are you gonna hit with this now i think this card is just bad in arena this card is this card is also really bad you're not gonna be able to hit a lot two ones with it right one ones two ones no this is pretty bad no i don't like this card this card is shitty all right Uh, yeah, I talked about this. this, this uh, Alright, this one's new. Uh, next card is Rotten Apple Bomb. 5 mana, 4, 5 taunt. Okay. Death Rattle, restore 4 health to your hero. So it's like a... It's like a Mistress of Mixtures. With second rate Bruiser, I guess. Right? Man, 5 mana, 4, 5 taunt is like really low stats. But the fact that it restores 4 health to your hero is... Hmm. I mean, this could be good. This, all could, this card also reminds me of Bubblies and Yummies, right? Bubblies and Yummies is a 4 mana, 4, 4 battle card, restore 4. That one doesn't have taunt. So you pay 1 more mana for 1 more health and 1 more taunt. That's actually a good deal. Yeah, you would do that. So... Yeah, maybe it's like... It's kind of like a Belcher too. Hmm. This card might make control decks. But I think this is just a warlock card, right? I think this is just a warlock card. You really need the Death Rattle to always go off for this to be good, right? This seems like a card exclusively for warlock. What other cards needs the restore health clause? Okay, fine. If if the new meta is all pirate warrior and face hunter, then maybe this will make maybe this will see play. But I don't think this is going to be that insane. So, realistically, I think this card is just average. Nightmare Amalgam. Oh my god, what is happening to this artwork? It's like a super fat murloc head with a robot claw and a totem hand. And then there's a tiny pirate demon soul coming out of his chest and demon oh my god this guy is freaky dude wait so three mana three four all minion this is an elemental mech demon murloc dragon beast pirate and totem at the same time so it's everything at the same time dude oh god wait a second three mana three four hmm. so obviously this would be an auto pick in arena because three mana three four is already good and it activates all your synergies right Wait a minute. This gets destroyed by Hungry Crab. <laughs> Yo, this actually gets wrecked by Hungry Crab. And Sack Pack and stuff like that. That's actually kind of funky. But, yeah. I guess um, I guess in Arena, it's really good. The fact that it could actually make Constructed because it's all these tribes. It's, actually, it's kind of interesting. You know? Like, it's kind of interesting. Oh! I'm assuming this also affects discover effects. So all the discover effects got a little worse. So say you play something like, oh, I don't know, um, Nether Spy Historian, you might discover this thing. Or if you play Servant of Kalamos, you might discover this thing. So it's a little bit of a discover nerf, I guess. Yeah, I guess I guess not much to say about this card other than if there's a deck that really needs to curve out. So for example, like a Dragon Priest right now might even put this in. Like right now in this meta, because Dragon Priest doesn't have a lot of good three drops, right? So I think if you're making a tribal deck and you really need a, you, you really need the three drops for the curve, then you might play this. But otherwise it's kind of like a it's kinda of like I think it's just solely an arena card. Yeah. Bubblies and yummies. <laughs> oh man. Uh, Muck Hunter. 5 mana, 5, 8. Wow, that's a pretty damn good stats with Rush. Battle Cry summon 2. 2 1 Mucks for your opponent. Well, there's a spelling mistake here. This 2 should be TWO. I don't think this is the official card. 
because the M is also covering the attack. Yeah, I don't think this is the real card. I think this might be like a fake card. Like the fake card is in like a translation, I guess, right? But a five out of five eight rush, so you kill their two one. You left with a five six, and they have a two one. That's not really good. So I guess you have to combo this or something. You have to combo this with like a whirlwind effect or like an MC tech or like a potion of madness or something. This seems like just strictly an arena card as well. But this is this seems like a pretty good arena card, right? Because most classes have a deal one damage, right? Like. Yeah, most classes hero power is like deal one damage. So you can play this, deal one damage to one of those, uh, at turn seven, right? Uh, this is I think this is the arena card. The fact that it cannot hit face is a big bummer. Like if this can hit face, then it's ridiculous. But you can't hit face with this, so you have to combo this or something for it to be even see constructed playable. And I don't think it's constructed playable in that case. Yeah, not a fan of this. Oh, that's it? Oh. Okay, not not that many big cards. And so those are all the new cards of the, the that were just revealed. I think the card that has the most promise from this will be just like Lord Godfrey. Godfrey, I guess? Because AoE spells are always kind of like interesting. Hagatha may be really good. Because hero cards hero cards just tend to always spawn a deck, I guess. And um, yeah, that's it. So I guess you guys can tune in next time for another episode of Mars Reviews New Cards. Alright, so that's the YouTube video. Alright, what do you guys think? Rush can never hit face. No, Rush can hit face after the turn after the turn they played. So the turn they played, they can only charge charge minions. So it's kinda of chompy. Mock Hunter. Man, this card is spooky. Wait, I like how this pumpkin peasant, it actually changes forms. That's pretty cool. Yeah, alright, cool. Let's play another arena. Alright, what do you guys think about those cards? What do you guys think? The four mana druid spell is trash. I think it'll, all, it, it'll, it'll either be garbage or really good. There's no in between with that card, right? Four mana summon wisp equal to your hand size? Not sure about that. Oh wait, I actually told Hawks to shut up. Let me unshut this guy up. Wait, I have, a, I have a quest for a pack, right? Rogue Mastery, okay, I guess I'm playing Rogue. So can I get the pack? I can get the pack right now. Amaz, if you summon a rush minion, can you hit face of it? No, you can't. So hunters don't want rush. How much does one charge? Amaz, don't you think the... Wait, what? Amaz, don't you think the... Shaman... New Shaman card can make a good deck of elemental package? Not really. I mean, what's so special about that? It's, it's only kind of normal. No, it's nothing special. Card review on my YouTube. YouTube.com slash messages. Alright, cool. Uh, I hate you, Kenny. Thanks to the three. Amaz, the depths of yesterday unstable evolution would not be labeled as an echo card because at the end of the round, it goes away from your hand. Inferring that echo cards do not go away from your hand at the end of the round. That is not true. There is no way. There is a 0% chance that echo cards stay in your hand after it, after it gets played. Okay? That would be like a huge design flaw. Alright? You just gotta use your common sense. There's a... Wait. Like, you just name any echo card, right? Like, 3 mana, 2, 4. Phantom Militia. Right? You're telling me that this, you can always play this? No, like, just, you have to use common sense. There's no way, if you include this card, you can always just play this. So what, every turn, every turn you're just gonna play 3 of these? No, like, you gotta use common sense, dude. Alright, let's play Rogue. Alright, Bone Drake is great. Uh, Drable is great. Yeah, this catch is good. Man, I really don't like Bookworm. I really don't like Bookworm, man. Uh... 
Do, 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 do we want this? Do, 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 do. I mean, I guess to make the best deck, I do go Dragon Rogue. It's kind of weird, I guess. I don't know. Thing here. Um, does how Master Shaws affect me? Your minions can't attack face ever. Dude, Rush just means the turn it gets played, it can attack minions. That That's all it means, okay? So you don't need to overcomplicate it, all right? Just... Turn it plays, it can attack minions. Uh, Lotus Agent is fine here, I guess. Just the same. These new cards. I think Faceless is actually really good. I'm gonna take it. Bobblies and Yummies. Is Death Speaker better? Nah, I don't think Shroom Brewer is actually fine. OMG, this chat? I don't know, man. You guys have some... I don't want to be mean, I think, but there are some stupid questions, dude. <laughs> like, think of your question a while before you... Before you ask it, you know, like, I don't know, man. I appreciate you guys and I love you guys, but goddamn, I have to call you out sometimes. Amaz, the frog is great, even if it's a zero one. The taunt helps to protect your two drop, for example. Why it's zero one is not good is because it doesn't affect the board. So, no, I don't think it's good. I actually don't think it's good. A one one can trade upwards, whereas a zero one can never trade. Uh, chalk loom eater, I guess. There once was a man near from Gilneas. Perdicious is fine. Perdicious is fine, but boring. I'm just gonna take the Elven Minstrel here. Cube is awesome. How is Cube the same win rate as Humongous Razor Leaf? I refuse to believe that. Are we jading it up here? I guess so. Oh my god, these are amazing. I think it has to be sap, right? Bruh, thanks for the three dollars. But when it can attack the turn it was played, why would you attack a minion and not the face? Because it's a different keyword than charge. You know? It's just a different keyword. Um, it protects the two drop, hence it affects the border mods? I don't think so. I don't think it, 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 I don't think it does anything. Zero one taunt is actually really bad. So, yeah. I, 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 I'm not a big fan of that card. I think this has to be sap. I think SI is actually the worst card here, right? I would pick Eviscerate before SI. So, Sap. Sap deals with anything. I love this card, but I have to pick Luke Hoarder here. I have so many 4s already. Oh, this card is amazing. I, I really want Splash Burglar, dude. But it has to be Bone Mirror, right? Shuriken. Damn. Com coupled with Deadly Poison? I think Jay Shuriken is actually better, right? I'm still very early, we still could get some um, Jade cards. Shadow Blade, easily. Auto pick, auto pick. Number of Death Rattle cards is not enough. Leeching Poison? That seems terrible. Guess it's, guess it's this one. Dom, thanks for the three dollars. Amaz, when you play Echo, does it make the copy zero mana cost and you can play the same some turns so you can spam Death Wings? No, it's the same mana cost. Same mana cost, dude. Amaz, what does Pot of Greed do? Oh my god. <gasps> Help! Ah! Amaz, so Ice Hawk gets changed to Rush as well? No, no, no. No, no old cards are getting changed this time around. Oh yeah, I just took the minion here. Wow, SI7 and Venom or Faldora? Are you kidding me right now? These are insane cards. BJ Cranda, thanks for the Prime sub. And Venom Weapon, right? And Venom Weapon is so good. Yeah, I think I want more Venom. Wild Pants, thanks for the sub. BJ Cranda sent sub. Avery Shuro, thanks for the Prime sub. Man, I am happy. I, why, why are so many people subbing? Oh, thank you. Hey, that's that's pretty awesome. Thank you guys. Oh, I have to pick Shadowcaster. I love this card too. Huckster, easy. I'm picking over Basilisk. Fairyman actually does good work with especially if like Shadowcasters and you know stuff like that. And then the journey. Uh, this one's a yikers. Hmm, this is fine. Ooze is also fine. I, I, I mean, I'm in the market for another 4-3. Like a 3-mana 4-3. Don't think the 2-drop is bad either. Alright, I'm just gonna take this. 
I mean, I'm jading right now. United won. This took 24 months. It happened. It finally happened. OMFG. I'd like to thank all my friends, all my chat, who I love so much. Amaz, you are forever my sexy man, and I will be your mod senpai forever. 24 month rainbow badge hype. Oh, poggers, dude. Thank you very much, United won. That's actually pretty cool. Uh-huh. Yeah, that's really good. Uh Palu Forger. Yo, you gotta be kidding me. Alright. I think it's actually oh my god, this actually is too close. I think it's Snow Defender. Wait, what the hell? Amaz, you need to watch the church reveal stream at around 38 minutes. He explains the echo stays in the hand. Dude, please, guys, don't stop talking about the echo thing, okay? You need to use common sense. Please use common sense, okay? It works exactly as I described it. It's like unstable evolution. Can I just pick Stonehill? Jabated? That guy's not jabated, dude. That guy's a sub and he didn't use Kappa. You know, I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Like, I love you, sub, but like. Oh my god. Condis, thanks to the three. Amaz, do Echo make it so your enemy only can attack with minions too? So your enemies can only win with spells? I, okay, guys, can you please read this? Like, okay, I, I'm actually going crazy, dude. What the hell is this? Okay, I'm just gonna ignore that. Amaz, do Echo make so your. Enemy only can attack minions too. Ay ay ay. Alright, um. Wait, scale being works with bookworm, right? I guess scale being does work with bookworm. I can't find it. And he's also access so just QA. Alright, take it. This deck is fine. God damn it, dude. Amaz going crazy. La 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 la. Valera versus Kerash. Victory or death. Watch your back. All right, we'll keep the QA. Why not? Hey, sorry, thanks for doing this. If Echo stays in your hand, you'd mill yourself. Yes. I'm just gonna say yes to these things now, okay? I'm just gonna say yes. This is my default answer. I love omelets. I love omelets. Hey, give me that. Oh, nice. You wanna buy a funnel cake? Okay. Dude, this deck is actually really good. Are you guys kidding me? Dude, look at my deck. My deck is awesome. Thank you. Hey, word as fists. Thanks for the prime sub, man. That is a that is a mouthful. The word wait, words as fists. That is a really hard to pronounce word, dude. Alright, what am I doing here? The shadow beckoned. Nah, I'm just gonna scale bane. Scale bane is great. Force of the I'm also thinking about the new Warlock Legendaries. They seem okay. They don't seem like it's gonna be core, which is important, I guess. Like when Mal'Ganis was released, it was so strong that every deck that played demons kind of needed Mal'Ganis. I don't think it, I can, I didn't even make a functioning deck without Lord Godfrey or the girl thing. Ice Popple, this is three dollars. Amaz, Echo makes so you can have three paveling books on the same turn. Can you get three power blocks and win the game on turn you play Echo? Yes. Venom weapon. Wait, what the hell is that? Has attack equal to your armor can What? Put this card is card is garbage. So many options. Dude, what the hell, dude? Oh my god. Give me 
Maybe I have to steal more of his- wait, does Journey Below get me any... thing? Oh, I could get the 2 mana tier 3 that gains me 3 armor. Yay. Whoop, they freaking do. Amaz, is Trump better than Hearthstone than you? <laughs> joke of the day. Wow. Give that guy a joke of the day reward. Below something up. I think we do this? That's actually not sure, right? Here we go. Alright, I'm just gonna dagger up. I'm not really sure, but I have Envenom weapon next turn, so... A fresh dagger seems pretty good. What we do? What we do? That's good. Wait, these are all garbage. I have to drill the claw. I guess drill the claw is not that garbage. Right? I mean, it has taunt. Could be good. I don't think warriors have any good spells to get, so this is fine. Amaz, if a minion has charged and play and you play Hamas the Shaw, can it go face? Actually, no. My thanks. <laughs> uh, okay, that, that, that's a play. Um, you know, I actually think it can attack face. So if you play like Hellmaster Shaw and you play Stone Test Four, I don't think the Stone Test Four can go face because it's charge and rush and rush is the thing that makes it so that it can't attack face so yeah charge and rush actually have like anti-synergy an yeah i think it actually has a little anti-synergy which is kind of interesting uh just did that are you taking another bone mirror here hello here we go. You didn't read it though. Oh, sorry. Um, thank you, Anonymous, for three. That is right. If Echo stays in your hand, you would know yourself. That is why they're rotating out Cold Light Oracle. That way you can keep all the cards forever. Man, I swear, each donation is reducing my IQ by like 10. And I don't have any more IQ to lose. Amos, Rush doesn't restrict attacking phase, it just enables attacking minions in the first turn. Oh, really? Alright, if that's the case, then I think... Then, yes. Then I think that that works then. Yeah, that would make sense if it works though. Like, otherwise Rush and Charge is very... Not Malia, new... Not friendly to new players. Yeah. I will fight yeah, I can, I can buy that. Once, I will buy that. Hey, Pico, this is a three. I'm on, are they making the Hearthstone of FPS game? Because in the FPS game, you have Echo Rounds like Hearthstone is making now. And why would they put in Echo Rounds in Hearthstone if there are no weapons to buy? Guys, help me, please. Save me. Save yourselves. No, you know what? I'll buy that chat. I'll buy that. I think you guys are right in that one. Like, when I think you guys are right, I say you guys are right. <laughs> but man, some people just think that when you play an Echo card, it stays in your hand forever. That cannot be right. That can never be right. Eureka! No, United One. I don't think Adapt is changing at all. I don't think that's... That would be too confusing. Buy one! Time to die. 
Sign me up. That's a good card. Oh. oh my god, this card is useless. Woohoo. This cube is a sad cube. Thank you, Anonymous with three. Did you get an invite to MTG Arena? If yes, any MTG Arena anytime soon? Yeah, maybe. Perhaps. Perhaps. That one is actually a perhaps. Perhaps, 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 dun 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 Here we go. Amaz, name one streamer better than you in arena? Hardest question I've ever been asked. Such a tough question, man. Wow. Tough hard question. I'll come back to you on that one. Alright, um, what am I doing here? Man, everything is just kind of bad here. I think this is just... Yeah, let's just do that. I think it's Getaway Kodo. Oh. Oh. Well, that, 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 that's Thank a... You. That's a yikes moment. Yikes. That is a yikes. Oh, that's a yikes. Shelfsy, thanks to the three. Hey, Moss, I just want to ask which legendaries I should craft for right now, or should I wait for the new expansion? Um, yeah, I will wait for the new expansion. There's no reason not to, right? I mean, the new expansion should probably come kind of about in a month or something. Yeah, somebody tells me I'm gonna lose this game. I, I just cannot buy tempo back. This feels bad. Truth is my shield. Truth is my shield. Thank you to Lord Matsu for the 13 months. When are you gonna play Into the Breach again? Oh, we have to see about that one too. Into the Breach was not as good as FTL is. FTL was amazing. Yeah. Alright, I feel like in this position, I have to YOLO. Um, I don't think if I, I win if I don't YOLO here. Shifu. Shifu, Shifu. Shifu is not that good. What can I actually get? Sap? White Eyes is obviously terrible. I guess I'm taking the Shifu. Job done. Oh, good shit. Oh, never got back tempo. Oh. No more take candles. Reporting for duty. Damn, if I put if I got white eyes now, that would have been amazing, huh? Alright, alright, okay, okay. Could be good. Ah! 
I don't have AoE in this deck. Oh, fuck. Reporting for duty. Reporting for duty. Reporting for duty. And Venom weapon. Well. Well. It's an out. Here we go. Well, wow, actually, this is kind of rude. The shadows beckon. What if I cube this? Man, if I cube this, that's actually pretty good. But I have to take this damage. So many options. I mean, okay, I lose to any secret, right? Let's be honest. I lose to every single secret. Justice shall prevail. Oh. Um 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 Why this say I lose to any secret? Um that was bad? Man, that guy had really good use of his redemptions. His redemptions are OP. You asked for it. Watch your back. Wait, what? Amaz, um means vag in Turkish, don't say that. I, I, I'm not speaking Turkish, you digital dummy. Oh my god, that reminds me of the... How much IQ does a turkey have? <laughs> oh man, that was a funny one. Man, that was, that was a good one. That was a good one. I mean, I have to play this. The question is, do I play this? I guess I don't. Here we go. Yeah, because I can either do this and play Elven Minstrel or questing and play this. That doesn't make sense. <laughs> All right, what do we get? I I mean, I don't know what I was expecting. Wait, Molurker is actually really good. Jade Swarmer is also pretty. Yo, all these cards are pretty good. I'm just gonna pick Daddy Wing though. Daddy Wing is amazing. Has to be Daddy Wing, right? Cause like it activates my Bookworm, so makes sense. Who goes there? Who goes there? Oh. Ta -da. Oh. Everything worked out. Give me a quest. Mind if I roll me? Okay. Just do that. <sighs> Jade Swarmer and Cube. Jade Swarmer and Cube is pretty cute. Yeah, it's not bad. Avion. Ooh. 
go in there. Damn, AVN doesn't. Hmm. Hey, give me that. Shuriken is pretty good, All right? Because it actually activates this. Yeah, still buffs this because poggers. Oh my god! Oh my god! Okay. Oh, it doesn't really matter. Okay, thank god. That scared me for a second. Okay. It's kind of spooky. Oh, get wrecked. Get wrecked. Oh, I'm hitting your face, dude. <laughs> I am going face, my friend. Oh. What? Bubblies and the hummies. They can't attack though, so it's kind of awkward. But hey, I would take a five mana twelve ten. It seems pretty good. Ah. Oh. Why is he shipping the frozen one? a little washroom break get some more tea when we come back we'll continue with this deck okay and you know what we'll open all the packs today all right let's just open all the packs today we gotta do that sometime all right so brb my friends really quick really quick amaz needs some more liquids Great. Do you guys like my shirt? It's a Hearthstone shirt. Hearthstone! Woo! Alright, let's see. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. By the way, another shout out to my Discord channel, dude. Discord channel where you can actually get direct messaging with me, okay? Like, you can um, actually put like ideas for stream, poly. Cackles. <laughs> you know, like. You know, just let me know what's up and there's like stuff that I kind of want to uh, need help with, you know, a mod's emotes and stuff like that and everything. So, uh, yeah, that's, um, just go ahead and join my Discord, dudes. Discord is poggers. Show not safe for work? No, no, no. There's a not safe for work category there and tread at your own risk, okay? So, yeah. I don't know. Like, a lot of you guys actually watch me at work. So, maybe that's not the brightest idea? A 
Hamas notice us? Yeah, I'm noticing you guys. I'm noticing you guys. Amaz, is there any not safe for work picks of you in there? No, there isn't. And if there is, probably photoshopped. This deck is actually really fun. It has a lot of combos. Usually in arena you don't get many combos, but ropes, ropes have combo pieces. And once again, I don't have Vile Spine Slayer. Every time, dude. Never draft that card. Baby Rage. Amaz, you don't show us memes when you leave anymore? Oh my god. Yo, I actually, um... I saw this beautiful thing. Let me show you. Dude, someone look me this beautiful picture. Look at that! Oh my god, that is beautiful. What about this? This is Monka Stare. Wow. This is Amaz W. Wow, this is great. Actually, we also have a new, um, so someone actually sent a new emote suggestion. Do you guys like this? This is Amaz Poggers. Do you like this? This is pretty- Oh my- uh, This one is kind of weird, dude. This is actually kind of creepy. But this one looks kind of cute. You know, like, I can see that one. The Amaz Poggers one looks a bit weird. Looks a bit spooky. <laughs> oh boy. Alright, I guess I'm seeing Karen. Alright, the creepy one or the green one? Creepy or green? Which one do you guys like? <laughs> Man, the creepy one is really creepy though. Both are creepy? You guys want the creepy one? Dude! Like, what's wrong with my eyeballs in this picture, man? Oh my god. Like, that is actually a what face. Hmm, this is a hard turn. I think it's this. As bad as this looks, this helps me set up for Jade Spirit next turn, and also refreshes my dagger for Envenom Warping. Amaz, my mother thinks that you're cute. Oh, thanks, Mom. Thank you! Alien! Thanks for the 18 months. A Moss Scam 1, a Moss Scam 2. A Moss Scam 3 and a Moss Scam 4, right? Oh, you mean those like blown up uh, pictures? That could be pretty cool, I guess. You know, the four slot ones. You know, lately I've been addicted to blueberries. Is anybody else addicted to something? Man, blueberries are pretty yummy. They're pretty okay then. That's a little overreaction. Well, I mean, jaded up, right? Well, that was a huge overreaction. Necro Leaf, thanks for time, sir. Why are you hitting face? That does not make sense, my friend. Don't do that. Oof. That was a pretty shitty play by him. Take hot, young one. I could have also hit the gear and killed him, but eh. I think I win late game. Oh, baby. Easy 
and then weapons. Amaz, I really like you. You always make me happy while you stream your laugh and everything makes you... Makes me pleased when I wake up in the morning. Oh, that's good. That's good. I'm glad. I'm glad you guys are just happy to watch my stream. That's actually really nice. I cannot stab this, I think? I kind of want to stab it, though. Oh my god, this guy. This guy rage quit. Amaz fans are like the new hit thing, dude. Valera versus Gul'dan. Your soul shall be mine. Watch your fans meet up, man. I really need to make a Hong Kong fans meet up. I really, really do. I've been pushing that up away for like a while now. Any requirements to be a moderator? Uh, I mean, I don't know. I usually get more mods when I actually need more mods. And right now, I don't think I need any more mods for now, right? I'm just like chilling. <laughs> you are so, my own fun yeah. cake. When there are positions open, it, I kind of like, it's kind of like a very um, instantaneous kind of thing. Like, oh, I need more mods. So let's get more mods. That's actually pretty good. No, oh, maybe I should have pulled this, but I'm not sure. I mean, this is fine. I have Envenom weapon, right? Fresh, Fresh from Kazakus! Just let ASM UK do the work. ASM UK appreciation, happy face. Wow, lots of happy faces. Hey man, questions on dust rules for Hall of Fame rotation. Will I get my golden or regular cards as I have both? Yes, you get all your dust back. In all Ooh, what do we have here? I think healing touch is actually fine. I'm gonna take the touch. I think the touch is great. Especially when I've invented weapon. This makes this better. I will purify the fallen. Give me a quest. Here we go. The touch of Am I gonna play Far Cry? Yo, I actually see a lot of people play Far Cry. It's like a new game, right? But I'm not really an FPS guy, so I think I'm gonna pass on that one. When's Starkest Dungeon 2 coming out? You know, that'd be good. So many possibilities. Wait, what? Do this ASIM, do that ASIM, but never, but never how are you ASIM? Dude, ASIM's cool, man. ASIM don't need no role-playing. Damn, I kind of want a bone mirror here. Oh, what the hey, dude. Like, this is big. 
big. Okay. Big is good. Big is good. Dude, I actually hanged out with Asim already, okay? Like, I saw him in real life. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. I'm a caring person. Is this actually lethal? No, it's not. I'm one off. I need one damage. King's Bane? <laughs> not that kind of one damage, dude. Next again. Nice. I don't think I miss lethal. Yeah, that one I don't miss. I didn't miss lethal. Amaz, how many weapons is too many weapons for arena warrior? I think in arena for warrior, you probably want like as many weapons as you get, like 10 weapons maybe. I just know that in my paladin decks, I want three fine cleavers. Like three is like the optimal amount. You always want a Vine Cleaver on turn 7 as a Paladin. Valera, so the think about that with Warrior, right? Like, how I often do you want a Blood Razor on turn 4 and Arcana Reaper on turn 5? Then you kind of adjust. I guess I lose the cube, right? Amos, how triggered do you need to be to permaban people? Now, my, my, my way of permabanning people is that I permaban stupid people. Like, usually if you're like, just like, spamming or trolling or whatever, it's just a timeout. Like, for me to permaban you, it doesn't mean you trigger me. It's, I actually think you don't contribute anything to chat. So, that's why I like permaban. I rarely, rarely permaban. Wait, what? I got a $10 donation, dude. Wow, that's really good. Thank you. From Anonymous. No message, though. Thank you for 10 Thank you. Oh, that's really nice. We're all effed? No, dude, dude, oh, don't, don't overreact, okay? You guys are cool, you guys are cool. I like you. Don't worry. Oh, nice. Nice. 3-1. I'm so used to 3-1 being good back then, because, like, when I... In, 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 in Magic, a 3-1 is actually amazing, because there's no hero powers in Magic. So, yeah, three ones are actually really, really good. So, this is really good. I can actually copy uh, Jade Swarmer and not be unhappy. So, he has to hit this then. Wow, oh, this card is good. I mean, okay. Here we go. Just a three mana two four, nothing too special. It does survive the weapon though, so that's good enough. I am master of magics. What the hell is that card? What is that card? Mm, face is pretty obvious here. Whoa, what is that? Oh, oh, hmm. Okay, I, I guess that's it's not unreasonable. This only works. I I see see oh, that was actually fine. Especially if he has another weapon here. Like, if he has Hammer of Twilight here, that would make a lot of sense.
Well, at least the dollar I mage can't kill anything now. Wait, some of them got an upgrade. The 2 1 changed into a 2 3. Yeah, so it, this got upgraded. It's kind of cool. Is there any way to buff this up? Bone Mare, Scale Bane. That's about it. Man, that, that Devolve is, was not that good. Something tells me that he is AoE. I got this. Here we go. Right away. I'm gonna tread lightly here. Oh boy, he is not gonna like what I have. Anonymous, thanks for three. King's Bane was lethal, my arena master. 9 9 plus King's Bane plus girl plus heal is 14 damage, but never mind what I understand. Clap. What? Oh, King's Bane was not lethal. Don't be a foolish fool. So he's overloaded for three. He's gonna play Earth Elemental next turn. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a card. Give me a quest. Yeah, that's a cob. Mm. Oh, where do you find these cards? Alright, so far this Venom Weapon has been amazing. Has been like A plus. Well played. Well played. Has just A plus man. Is Rush better than plus one spell damage? Because Rush minions can kill stuff on their own, while spell damage minions need a spell to work? That's like, that doesn't make sense. That's like saying, is ice cream better than soy sauce? Right? And then soy sauce only works if you pair it with, a, with an actual food item. Like, you get what I mean? Like, two different things, my friend. Ice cream is better. <laughs> Alright, how about this? Soy sauce flavored ice cream. Wow. Are you guys poggers? Is that poggers right now in chat? Dude, Newberry brought me to a very weird ice cream shop. It was really good though. They have a lot of flavors, but they have also a lot of weird flavors like kimchi flavored ice cream. And like, there were a lot of weird ones. Wait, is Newberry actually here right now? He can tell you about all the flavors. That was a weird ice cream shop. There's like kimchi flavored ice cream. There's like red hot chili peppers. Man, that place was weird. Ah, that's a good draw. 
I just think the fruity ones. It's interesting because like I read an article that said the Asians prefer fruity flavors, and then I when I read that I was like, wow, that is so true. Wow, that is right. You're right. You know, that is so much more accurate than horoscopes. I mean, I just happened to be an Asian and I happened to like it, but I don't know. I feel like that was pretty accurate. God, he stopped giving me the shit. Wait a second. Wait. Wait, this actually has a little bit of context of the in Venom. Right? Huh. Huh. Here we go. That is interesting, I guess. I hate this card in Arena because you never want to draw it, but I guess I don't mind drawing a one mana poisonous weapon. That seems okay. Wow. That card's annoying. Do I just do it now? The chance of him playing two cards is really, really rare. I'm okay with this. Um, Jeff, thanks for the 16 months. Oops, I keep forgetting to unsub for 16 months. Hey, when you're 16 months, it's not you're forgetting. Is that you love this channel. You love a moss, and that's great. That's a good thing. What are the standings of the Hoppabet? I'm at 8 point something, I don't remember. 8 point something. So, so I want to get rid of this weapon ASAP, right? Because I want to draw it again. It's kind of weird, but makes sense. Oh no! Oh. That tickled. Oh, Alright, we'll move some value. Shadow play seems pretty good too, but I just have to be careful with turn 7. Turn 7 is the Abyssal Enforcer turn, right? That looks like a suck. Phoenix, alright. I'm okay with that. Oh, Jesus. Here we go. Tempo! Alright, just gotta dodge an Abyssal. I don't have a play there that can beat the uh, Abyssal, so... I don't you, you, If you can't beat a card, your opponent doesn't have it. That's like my golden mantra. Just pretend they don't have it. Restos See? Always works. Works every time, 40% of the time. Oh, yes! That's what I'm talking about. Alright, let's see. I guess I'm trading off everything. I really don't want to trade off everything, but it does make sense. So, Here okay, this is can. happening for sure. This is happening for sure. This is happening... This one a bit more? And yeah, I have to trade. Because otherwise, Spellfire kills my boy. Yeah, this makes sense. Jade Rogamas? It's a little jady. Not too jady. I only have two uh, jade spirits and a jade shuriken. But we do have a lot of enablers, right? Join it below as a jade, usually. I have Fairy Man and um, Shadowcaster. No, don't! No, 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 no. Point your ugly arrow away from my horse. Don't, don't touch my horse. Don't do it. Okay. 
Easy game, easy life. Horse on horse action. Wait, oh, I, th I thought the game froze. I was like, what the hell is happening? Oh, Newberry, you're here. Yo, I was just talking about how we went to this weird ice cream shop that had all the flavors. You should actually s say some of the flavors in chat, the weirder ones. Yeah. Horseception? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I told them about the kimchi flavored. But then there was there were so many weirder ones too, right? Kimchi curry flavored ice cream, wasabi, Canadian bacon. Yo, I would actually try Canadian bacon flavored ice cream. I mean, I'm a Canadian, so... You know, I would try that. Canadian bacon flavored ice cream doesn't seem that bad. Wait, does it have like chunks of bacon inside it? <laughs> you will buy a funnel cake. Canada. You love nice. I love trading this off against the priest because they usually just like be an ass and just steal it. Only works on the wait. Wait, 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 wait. I play this? Shadowcaster? And play it again? <laughs> that is so troll, dude. Oh no. Oh no. That's. That. Oh. Easy trade. Oh no. That cannot be right, right? Yikes, I think I actually need to use this as value. Alright, let's trade first then. QA. Oh wait, I can't do this and then this, so that's a little awkward. Alright, I'm gonna go with the value play. Amaz, you wore Lu hype. You wore Lu hype, I guess. I didn't really experience University of Waterloo, honestly, because, you know... My mom kind of, you know, passed away when I was in university, so yeah. I don't know. It, it wasn't universe. It was a war loose fault. I don't think it was just like, you know, life problems. Fluffy Marie, thanks for the seven months. Got a promotion at work, so now I can spend money to resell poggers. Hey, thank you very much. Do I have any any elementals? I don't think so. Ooh, hey, nourish is actually not bad against priest. Oh wait, I do have elementals. I have Jade Spirit. Oh, I but I played it and it died. So that's kind of awkward. Uh. Alright, fine, we'll just pick this. Pick the valley card. But yeah. You know, it's because of that, that like, I, I actually feel like that I can't go back to Waterloo. Right? Just because of that. It's kind of sad. But, it's kind of how it is. Alright, what am I doing here? I guess I have to trade. I, 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 there's no way I play this, right? I wonder. Do I play this? I mean, my cards are really good. I don't want to play that. No, no way, right? No, that doesn't make sense. Okay, that doesn't make sense. What do I want to do then? I can go for a huge temple play here, but I don't think it's correct either. Give me a quest. Wait, that was a hard try. There are lots of permutations. A lot of things I could have done, but... Don't think that... I think this is just better. It puts more power on the board. 
You know what's funny? Benedictus would have been better there. <laughs> oh, Benedictus would have been better. Well, I mean, now that I drew a cube. <laughs> I have no idea what's in my deck. All right. That's the thing. Oh, I have no idea what's going to happen. Shade Spirit. Man, there are some really funky stuff that can happen. Alright, I think this is great. Yo, shadow cast on the cube and then cube the cube and then bring back the cube the cube the cube the cube. That's gonna be great. Okay, I think I'm just gonna do the combo, right? So, shadow cast this. Attack. Cube the cube, therefore killing the cube, but making a cube that doesn't get cubed. Attack this. And then sap whatever gets buffed. Wait, he had a dragon? I didn't even know that. That's yikes. That's fine. Wait, what? I don't have that card. Oh, Benedictus! Oh my god, dude. Oh my. Wait. Oh, that's so confusing. I don't even have that card. <laughs> Oh my, no, now this is getting to very... Okay, I, I, I have no idea what class I am anymore. <laughs> oh my god. I mean, I get double cubes here. Here we go. Die. <laughs> No, 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 <laughs> no, my second turn is too big, no, oh no, <laughs> calm down chat, what, wow, that was a, uh... That that was the thing, but wait a second. <laughs> I don't even have bone drink. In my oh, I do. Wait, that's, that's not my bone drink though. Otherwise, oh my god. Wait, what? Oh my god, I'm so confused. All right, um, this first. Wait, who's the dragon priest now? No, I'm, I'm the dragon priest. Hello, I'm dragon priest. Oh, baby. Alright, sure. My deck, my, my, my board is pretty good for FFA, I guess. Corpse Razor? Elixir is pretty good. There are some very stupid things that I can do with Elixir. 
But Corpse Razor is pretty good too. Oh, but then, oh no, this actually gets wrecked by Mind Control, right? I'll take the Elixir here. Elixir of Hope. Return a friendly minion. Oh my god. Ah, alright, well. Let's just go off base first. Oh my god. <laughs> Such a show game. Hey, dragon. That actually. Oh, Jesus. Alright, oh, that was pretty good. Oh, Bone Mare? That's a sign me up. You just Bone Mare on 8, okay? You just Bone Mare. Doesn't really matter what happens. Just Bone Mare. He should have lashed first. Oh yeah, I should have flashed first. Order L U L. Oh come on. <gasps> Shut up and die. I don't even have that card. Yo, Benedictus might be a tier one card. Dude, Benedictus won us that game. <laughs> oh my goodness, what the hell? Benedictus best arena card. <laughs> wow. That is a YouTube highlights moment. Cause I wanna troll them. And then they go like, Ed, where's the vid? Alright, Azim UK can mark it down. Hi YouTube, yeah. You know, it's funny because my title said that my car review is up on YouTube already. And then Ed was asking me, Why did you say it's up on YouTube when it's not yet? So yeah, it's Ed's fault guys. Ed, work faster! Get my review on YouTube, Ed! God, Ed. Amaz, God, I admit that was some pretty cool shit. Yeah, that was pretty. That was a fun game. I kind of lost track of all my cards that game. Amaz, when is the next Subnautica vid coming? It's coming soon. Happy New Year, friend. That's a, that's another Happy question for Ed, actually. <laughs> oh man. I feel like one day I should just like treat all the guys who work for me like to like a cruise or something. I don't know. To like a Japan or something. And we'll just have like fun. That'd be pretty cool, right? Let's start some trouble. Let's start some trouble. Venom weapon. Wait, I can't hear. Oh shit, I can't hear a part, right? Uh, is this Here we go. Look behind him. That'd be cool, right? Yeah. Look behind you. Look behind you. Here we go. Ah, uh, whatever. I have uh, Envenom next turn, so. Yeah. Fairy 
Fairy Dragon. Uh, Fairy Dragon's good because it activates the Bookworm. So what, I have no plays this turn? That's kind of a sad day. Yo, what if I sap the Taunt Totem? Is that stupid? Give me a quest. I don't think so. How could that be stupid? Yeah, this is fine. Cause like, I have so many kill spells. I have Bookworm that kills, I have Venom Weapon that kills. So I feel like that... That's not a very normal play. It's not a play that you'll make a lot, but... You know, I read a specialist don't come often as well. Yeah, just replace it. Wait, he messed up. He should've taunt- He should've told him first and then play this if he was gonna do that. Yeah, so now he doesn't get two taunts. That was a little bit of a misplay. A little misplay. It's an advanced strategy, guys. Okay? It's very advanced. I understand if you guys don't know what happened there. I understand. Darkness. It's actually kind of interesting. But obviously I want to darkness the bone mirror, right? So I'm just gonna slam jam these things out. Come on and slam. Alright, that's a bad card, thank god. Bone. Bone me. Cube is pretty interesting. Just bone there. Oh, it's it's always like that. Uh, every time you just wonder what to do, if you have a bone on turn 8, just play the vampire. Alright, like just play it, it's always good. Always good. That's not good. That's not uh yeah, that's actually pretty good. No, There's some degenerate stuff I can do right now. I really want to kill this though. Damn, alright, this is better. I mean, I want to draw cards and everything, but I just want to kill a sting. Alright, I actually like this play a lot. Alright, this is great. I mean, never mind, this is good, this is good. Actually, this is really ridiculous with the two coins. Yeah, we can do some very degenerate stuff. Unless he kills this. Then we're a little sad. Wait, does he have the thing? Oh my god, he had four totems. That was a bit scary. Oh my god. Okay, that's ridiculous. Alright, let's see here. So this hits this. We're gonna cube the char. Copy. Coin. 
Oh, actually, I don't even need to do that yet. Here we go. This is better, actually. Yeah, just wait, just wait. Just wait. Okay, so there's a chalk gloom eater here, right? So now there's even more chalk gloom eaters? And then loop order? And then what if I loop order the cute the loop order? And then chalk this? Oh my god. The combos, dude! Oh, <laughs> that's, a, that's a lot of stuff happening. And meanwhile, my opponent's just playing that, who cares? Devolve? Oh, Devolve would be really bad. Say, mm, lo, lo ka, say, sub, sub, yeah, I'm one off. That doesn't work, it becomes a... <laughs> This guy just killed himself. Darkness. Doesn't work that way, my friend. Take it. That laugh was awesome. Valera versus Anduin. The light shall bring victory. Watch your. Oh, that's right. Oh, man. Happy Guys, what? New Year. <laughs> Happy New Year. What if Ricky Martin was actually like Barack Obama? Wouldn't that be something? Like, maybe he's like a very popular person or something, I don't know. Man. What if, what if? That's a card. Oh, wow. I guess it's a dragon at least, so yeah. That is... Jinyu is pretty good. I mean, Jinyu has to be better than Hearing Touch, right? It's just like, no. Here we no contest. Ah. Wait, what? Amaz, what if Ricky is Barack Obama and Michelle Obama is 
Enrico and Glacius. Who the heck is that? What the heck is that? I have no idea what that is. Mm. Remember to save the sap for Lich King? Oh, that's actually a... Yeah. I actually have a lot of ways to deal with Lich King. I have, like, invented weapons. Oh, my God. Alright, I still have a 5-2. Not too bad. Why are you guys laughing at me? <laughs> oh my god. Alright, he wants to bone me too. That's fine. Uh, I can't really do anything about that, right? Alright, let's see what we get here first. Dude, what have to do with that? Alright. Oh. Well, I can bounce them back and stuff, so I guess it's okay. Whoa, if I carnivorous cube Aya, that could be nice, but I think it's lethal already. Look, I'm just a piece of sum. Sum got sum is sub look sub bot. We're one off. Ay, ay, ay. That's an Aya moment. Get it? Because I. I Alright, let's just eat this one. Oh! Give me a quest. Here we go. Yep, temple against priest is just too good. Pretty good. FFA. Don't think there's a card he can get. You have been. Clappy, clappy, well played. 9 1, baby. Amaz, don't you know Enrique Inglesias? Is it, it what, what is that? Dude, I don't even know if that's a guy or girl name. It might be a girl name, honestly. Like, is she a singer or something? Valera versus Troll. Wait. Watch your. Wait. What? Wait. I thought Ricky Mardo was a priest. Wait. Wait a second. Um. Hello. Huh? <laughs> what? Happy New Year, friend. He acts like Ricky Martin. Happy New Year. It's Ricky Martin's second form. <laughs> so stupid. Oh my god. It's the Ricky Martin Sniper Guild. Okay, everybody, don't change your name to Ricky Martin. Okay, that's a terrible idea. What the hell? I wonder. We ended up in our timeline, but 
But in this timeline, Amaz is also an arena specialist. Ooh. Mmm. <laughs> that is pretty good. Monsters behind you! Or squid face. Honestly, monsters behind you is actually not that bad. There's some interesting combos I can do with this too. Though the self is just a really solid card. Alright, I'm gonna go with self here. Yeah. Let's go with solid card. That's okay. Alright, I'm pretty glad I picked this now. Dire Wolf Doki? Dire Wolf Doje. Amaz, wait, what? Ricky Martin's true identity is Ben Brode. Dun, dun, dun. Ow, that kind of tilted my neck. <laughs> Ouch. Oh man, ow. Oh, my neck. <laughs> oh, the things I do for you guys. Man, work related injury. Ah, and these things. And people think that streaming is actually not a stressful kettle. Oh my god, dude. Man, streaming is perilous. Oh. 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 <laughs> laughing at the same time that's not good ah. oh man you know people think that esports is like really really low and stuff but man you can get like work related injuries in esports too all right oh man that hurt oh, jesus Oh. Ali Catastic, thanks for the 269 bit. Says, We're all Ricky Martin, Amaz Scam. Alright, I'm getting better, guys, don't worry. Man. That's fine. Work related injuries, dude. I mean, that's a card, I guess. <laughs> I'm just gonna kill this dude. This card is really annoying. It's not even a card. Alright, that's how annoying it is. Amaz, if you stretch and walk every day, you'll feel better? Wait, you mean like walk outside? Like, outside my house? Have you seen the show Rick and Marty? I actually have never seen a single episode of it. Yeah. Honestly, what scares me the most about Rick and Morty is that the fans are just so... fanatical, you know? That scares me the most. Like, those guys are crazy. Oh, jeez. That's a lot of card draw. Bookworm and bone drink? Ooh, how about that? <laughs> outside? That seems dangerous. Yo, that is- Outside is actually very dangerous if you think about 
right? Like, have you ever heard of a car crash inside a house? Exactly, dude, exactly. You actually have? Okay, then you're crazy. I'm outvaluing this guy so hard. It's unbelievable. The hell is that? Totemic Might? The totem totem buff thing? What the heck did that be? Oh, wait, what does it have now? So it's resummon an egg. My totems? My BT totems? I actually want to take less damage here. There's no way I die, right? My totem. My totem. Yeah, I'm just gonna take less damage here. I don't want to die to like random bloodless or something. I think I got the value handled. Faceless the egg? I don't want to faceless the egg. The problem with faceless the egg is really bad. It's because it spawns 0 3. The good thing about getting the egg is that I can get the shadow caster, but other than that, it's not really that good. What is that? Oh, I don't want to get fisted here. That's so bad. Man, getting fisted was not good there. I traded to Do I kill the hearing totem? This is actually pretty close. I guess I just still kill the spell totem. Actually, no, I have to kill the hearing totem because of this. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, baby. Dude, they should actually get me to do voice acting jobs on cards that have like a weird laugh and stuff, you know? I, I do a pretty good laughing job. Or like a weasel, you know? Like, weasel is like... <laughs> That's my weasel impression. <laughs> Not again. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> you guys love my weasel impression, alright? You guys love it. Give me a quest. Here we go. Man, I just don't think that face is correct. I think it's just trade here. Because I win the late game. Whoa! That's a volcano. Oh my- are you kidding me? Wait, I'm actually dead, right? Oh wait, no. What the hell is that dude? Like... He gets eight- I can wait all day. He missed lethal. That was a mistake. He missed lethal. He got a fireball, fireball, and he won. Oh my god, this guy is a... what? What the? Always little time. He ran out of time. Oh my god! He, if he runs out of time, he's dead. Aha! Incredible. Wait, what?
Well, it still has fireballs. But I'm still dead next turn. Feels bad, man. Oh wait, it was Ricky Martin. Oh shit, never mind. All right, no, never mind. Oh man, I got excited for nothing. Oh man. Oh Ricky Martin, never mind. Dude, I was so excited. But it was Ricky Martin. Damn, now I'm snout. No oh. Man, I was so excited. Man, no, no, no! I got jabated. Oh my god, that was jabated. Now I'm sad again. <laughs> Why does Ricky gotta jabate me? You will have another opportunity at 11 wins. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, what is this guy doing? This guy is roping me on turn one. Kill me, dude. Kalitas, thanks for the prime sub. Thank you. Trigger the volcano poggers. I have to kill the Mattide. Mattide is stupid. No Earthshock for the cube? That's true! Yeah, at least the Earthshock uh, for the cube is gone. Earthshock is a very good card, man. It's so good. Oh. Oh. Tick sword, my friend. Dragon scales. Oh. Ah, Seattle Blade. Ooh, that's um that's a juicy one. That is actually pretty juicy. But I think the mm, the cube is also pretty juicier, but I think Blue Meter is better at the end of the day. Because I can buff it up. Yeah. He might have a lightning bolt here or something, but eh, whatever. I can't live with that. That's a that's a yikers moment. Ooh, Jade Spirit. Let's go. All right, got a bone there. Very juicy bone there. Next turn. It has infinite attack already. The buff is useless. Well, no, I can go face with it, right? It has quadrupled the attack if I go face. That's not nothing. What a 
What kind of order, dude? Another manatide? I. These manatides be annoying my ass. That's annoying. Dude, why is he trading? I already said I'm gonna trade for you, dude. Oh my god, this guy did. Alright. Lucky two? Lucky two. I can't use that properly. Adapt? Farsight? Honestly, Farsight might just be good here. Cause like, these are just trashed here. Alright, I'm gonna take Farsight. Ta -da. Oh, ta Alright, just keep it. Yeah. Dude, what the hell, man. So this guy went to 10 wins just because of Crackling Doom. I never draft Crackling Doom. I haven't drafted that card yet. It's... Well, now we know why this guy has 10 wins. Oh, that's actually pretty good. Give me Violet Illusionist. Should have saved Sap for Lich King. I sapped a 0 2. I think it was great. Oh no, I sapped a Spirit Wolf this game. Never mind. Lava Burst incoming. I mean, 7 health is definitely a little. You know, if it went face of the 7 7, I would have died. I'm just saying. I would have just lost already. So, this guy already missed Lethal. So right now I'm kind of just free rolling. Grail with Kappa Pride. I wish I had Kappa Pride actually. Bobblies and Yowies! That's actually very nice. Wait, I actually want this. Here we go. I'm all in. If he has another crackling too, then God bless my soul, dude. I'm 7 HP again. <laughs> I know, right? <gasps> Sleepins, thanks for the turn bits. I'm also like, playing variety games today. Uh, probably not. I'm I'm maintaining a very nice sleeping schedule, so. Ooh. This guy, like, so Oh my god, 
that's so that's actually stupid. I'm gonna wait for a while. I, I don't want to play against that guy again, man. Dude, you know, oh, he just he just needed to play his cards, and then he he's gonna win. He just needed to play his cards. Yikes! I'm just gonna wait a bit. That is ridiculous. Yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah. Just Lich King, three Jade Lightnings. It's double Pharaoh Spirit. What the hell? Double mana tide. Oh yeah, that's very fair. That is super fair. He literally did not play a bad card, right? What's the worst card he played? He didn't play any bad cards. What face? You can't queue with that guy again because he's on 11 wins and you're on 10. Illiterate. Well, Mr. Scara, you can actually queue against high win rate opponents when you're at high, high numbers because there's not a lot of people in high numbers, right? 11 wins always queue against 10 and 9. But I guess you wouldn't know that. So, at least now you do. How was your day and where's your green tea? I'm, I'm drinking it. Green tea's great. Same opponent. Oh wait, no, it's not. All right, thank God. All right, okay, okay, we're saved. We're saved. I guess I keep the QA, right? I got a one drop. It's not gonna get better than this. Though. All right. How's your neck? It's better now. It's better now. Well. This guy has the same thing. Oh my god, let's go. Beautiful. Yo, why am I playing against all shamans? Is shaman the best class in the arena now or something? Like, what's happening? What's going on? Shaman's the best class now? Amaz, like the other day when Kibla was 7 0 and he knocked you up at 6 3. Yeah, I got Skamaz by Kibler. I guess I'll take the card draw. Here we go. Yeah, dude, Kibler was 6 0 and I was 6 2. And then he beat me with like an OP deck. And then he turned on my stream just to laugh in my face. How? Man, that hurt my feelings. My feelings are hurt. You and I are I'm okay. Quest accepted. Wow, if I cube the Huckster, that's amazing. Oh. Alright, it doesn't really- oh! oh my god, where do you find this card? That is insane. That's incredible. That is incredible, my friend. Holy. We, we are really doing it. QA Snowball. Three mana, eight, eight. Oh! Positioning. Oh. Wait, he killed that? What? Wait, this is actually not bad. Alright. Let's be honest here, Amaz. You wouldn't be doing anything right now if not for Benedictus. Benedictus best arena card. Wow. And now, for my next trick. And now, for my next trick. Good. The elements will destroy you. 
Gimme, gimme, gimme. That's fine. You know what the best thing for bone marrow is? I'm my own bone there. What's the best move here? Hmm, thinking. I'm okay with taking 8 damage here. I don't think that's a problem. And I think it's actually trade here. That's so weird, but... Man, that's weird. Alright, I can't do it. Either Rickards or Rios, I think, is the prime slot. I, I, I can't trade there. I, I just can't. It goes against my... Just... I just can't. I know this might get fisted. But... Alright, Hex is actually not that bad. Fist would be really bad there. Fairyman? Wait, what does Fairyman do? Fairyman doesn't do anything. Wait, this actually might be lethal. Oh shit, I should have ate the loot hoarder. That was a mistake. Eating the loot hoarder was better because... Well played. Well, I guess it's still fine. Is it gonna evolve? Okay, that's true. Guys, guys, if we get 12 wins, we're enabling Pepe Hop. Oh, baby. All right, let's see if we can do it. Final boss. We got this, right? We got this. Valera versus Garrosh. It's a warrior. Uh oh. Guys? Guys? It's a warrior. <laughs> oh no. Where's my. Ooh? Oh. There it is. Alright, alright, alright. Let's go. Let's go. There's a chance. Whew. Oh my god, it's okay. That's actually very scary. Don't <laughs> cut S. What warrior? What kind of deck would an 11 warrior deck most likely have? Eh, you know, just maybe 6 weapons, you know, lots of taunts and stuff like that. That's usually how warrior decks go, if they go high. Blazing Longsword, Blood Razor. Basically, I'm not gonna have a board, right? So how I'm gonna win is I'm gonna have to develop a board while also getting value. So something like Huckster would be amazing, right? Because you the... Basically. Oh, there's the weapon. Oh, order. Yeah. Monsters behind you. So, like, this is pretty good. Alright, I'll take it. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Man, these minions are just so good. They're so awesome.
Although, I guess there are a lot of warrior cards that I can't play. Like, you know, remember that thing we got the bladed gauntlet and that was really bad? How did Ricky Martin lose his game already? Dude, he just queued and he just lost immediately. What the hell? I like how the chat is like Chinese now, just because I said that. <laughs> God damn it, dude. Oh, man. Shout out to my Chinese viewers, I guess. See? See? It's always that. Oh my god, you piece of garbage. Dude, what the heck is that? Okay, um... I don't really want to ooze this because he has another weapon that's bigger. This document looks legally bad. Yeah, what the hell, man? I have to save the ooze for the bigger weapon. Wait, do you guys think he's actually sniping? I mean, this might be Arcana Reaper or War Axe or something. Oh, if it's War Axe, he would have played it, right? Hmm, sketchy. Sketch, 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 sketch. Do you guys want the sniper overlay? What now? Sniper overlay and evil. This guy is playing so slow. I know it's like an important game, but like, come on, dude. Snorefest. My hand is so good. It's pretty good. I wonder what I'm gonna play next turn. Next turn I have six mana. I wonder. Don't you guys ever find it that female characters have like very inefficient armor? Like, should it be very cold? Like, why are their waists always showing? Like, don't they get cold? Illusionist? Oh. I mean, I don't know what I drew. <laughs> What did I draw? Hmm, one has to wonder. Um, so many options. <laughs> ah, shit. Oh, right, whatever. I think illusionist is still right here. <laughs> All right, it's fine. Oh wait. In blood. I messed up, I messed up. Oh my god, Signed I actually messed up. Yikes, I messed up. This is actually good. Oh my god, I messed up. Yikes. Took one extra damage on my illusionist. Oof. I was actually thinking of two different things at the same time, so that's that's why. WTF is happening? We're oh my... 
I guess it doesn't matter. I lose all my cards. Oh, I don't think this guy's sniping anymore. Because there's a full spinning. It's not a card that he could have played there, so I don't think he's sniping anymore. I think he's a good boy. That's pretty good. Yeah, guys, I actually don't have all, all Sylvanas's. There once was a man from Gilneas. Man, that is enough value. I don't really need a fairy man this back. Because I honestly have enough stuff on the board. Right? I only want a fairy man if I drew, like, exactly loot hoarder and, like, QA or something. Right? This is fine. He waited specifically for you to use the ooze? Maybe. Perhaps. 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 What now? I don't think he's sniping anyone. Oh my god, that's a card. I guess I do it on the fairy dragon. Ta -ta. Right. He's sniping 100%. Oh my god, how do you know? How do you know, guys? How do you know? Like, you can't tell. It's really hard to tell unless they actually play specifically. You just, you just can't tell. How do you tell? The moment you turn off your overlay, he played slow. When it's on, he plays way faster. I mean... I mean, okay, okay, maybe. But he was thinking about where to trade. Like, he was thinking about where to trade or not, so I don't know. The smart play. Shadow players, dude. I'm okay with trading these days. Like you know, it, it's not a hundred percent. You never know for sure these things. Although if he were sniping, then I, I think he's sniping pretty badly. Oh my god, the juicy trade, dude. A juicy. Oh, Jesus. Well, there's no reason to hold this, right? Okay, actually, there is. There is. Um, QA, if I steal a card that's. All right, I'm just gonna hold it. I don't know. Anti sniper card. Well, even if we, uh, even if our opponent is sniping right now, he doesn't know what dragon I'm gonna get or what card I'm gonna top deck. So I think what it's like know? doesn't really matter. I don't think he's sniping, man. He just I think he just plays slow. Why not face this champion? Because card draw is more important right now because we're in top deck mode, right? Champion is not as strong when a card is more valuable right now. Why does he even need to think about this? Shouldn't he just slam jam both? Wait, why do you need to think about that? I don't want to play Nas Dormu here. Okay. 
Okay. I think this is better because I need to know what his Death Knight card is first. Damn, I think it's a board clear. He didn't play any- Oh my god, that's a card. Alright. This is actually really good because this he can't board clear. Boarding, sure. So now I don't really care. Because if he, say, death packs or something, then it doesn't really matter. I get, I get so much stuff back. Shell. Alright. Uh, guys? Guys? Wow. We did it. Wait, is it okay? Skype me that. Skype me that. Chat's going too fast. Oh, arena specialist. That's what I'm talking about. Dude, I will never let you guys down. 12 wins, baby. Thank you there. Um... Winds of War for the three dollar donation. I'm absolutely sniping you. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, Sirius the Hollow. Thanks for the four months. It's twelve wins. GG. Thank you, man. Thank you. All right. Uh, send me the link. Oh my god. Amaz Derp. Wait, why is it in sub mode? All right. Well, sub mode is actually pretty good. It's actually just a block of 12 wins. I like that, actually. Mm, I like that. Thank you, guys. Oh, that's, 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 that, was, that was fun. That was good. That was good. Alright. So let's go ahead and uh, open this. Shout out to Benedictus. Benedictus actually won me one of those games. Oh. Gotta be shitty. A shitty, shitty rewards. But I guess, you know, there's actually one reward that we have yet to open. That's the best one. Yeah? There's actually one of the best rewards. We're enabling Pepe Hop. This emote will be available in your channel shortly. Wow. Alright, you guys can refresh now. <laughs> oh my god, this email is so stupid. <laughs> ah, this emote is so stupid, dude. I guess it's kind of like a cute kind of stupid. Alright, we'll open packs until we open the legendary, alright? These are the normal packs, right? This, these packs make sense. It's time to play Guess That Legendary! Oh, Sleepy Dragon. Lion. 
Man, we haven't got 12 wins in a while. Pretty happy about that. Actually, no, that's not true, right? The last time I got a 12 wins is March 15th. Oh, no, 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 no. Sorry, March 21st, March 21st. That's actually last week. Wow, I haven't got 12 wins in a week. All right, that's actually pretty bad. Never mind. That is actually pretty bad. But you know, 12 is harder now. More, just good players with Hearthstone and everything. Yeah, Pyek. Oh my God, to my side. Yeah, yeah, to my side ended up being unplayable. This whole expansion, that card was basically just bad. It was a trap. Lionessa. Someone actually gets that Lionessa in chat just now, so... Alright, that was good. That was some nice packies. Alright. So, once again guys, thank you so much for uh, watching the stream. Enjoy your new Pepe Hop emotes. And once again, a big shout out to the YouTube channel where you can watch my card reveal. Um, Ed is probably gonna edit my video today. And it's gonna be up. So uh, make sure you guys check that out. That's Amaz HS on YouTube. Just check it down below. Wow, what a great channel, man. What, a, what, a, what an awesome channel. It's just perfect. And of course, if you guys want to talk to me when I'm not streaming and talk to some cool guys, make sure you um, just, uh, you know, just join my sub. Join, join my sub, not join my sub. Join my Discord! Exclamation my Discord. And then you can get the link. You can join for free. And uh, we can have some fun, yeah, too. All right, so um, yeah, I think we're good for today. I'm, I don't think I'm missing anything. So thank you for watching, guys. We will see you guys tomorrow. Uh, same time, same place. Uh, yeah, that's it.